let's move on to the next pattern the strategy pattern strategy pattern encapsulates an algorithm inside a class let's look at a java example i have a very complex class i mean there is a lot of business logic in it and one of the important things which it need, needs is it needs to be able to sort a set of items a sort a set of numbers one of the ways we can implement is we can directly implement the entire logic for sorting in there tomorrow if i want to change this sorting then i would need to change the implementation of that particular complex class instead of that what we can do is we can use a strategy pattern in the strategy pattern we kind of separate the algorithm of how the sorting is done from the complex class what we do is we are creating here an interface called sortable and we have couple of implementations of the sortable interface bubble sort quick sort i mean we don't really have the implementations in here but you can assume that bubble sort is implemented in here it's quick sort in here so thereby this complex class all that we need to do is we need to pass in what sorting algorithm to use i mean this this will not worry about how the sorting is done all that it expects is some kind of a sorting algorithm as an input and later it would use that sorting algorithm to sort and when we are creating the complex class to the constructor we would pass the exact algorithm to be used as an input so the users of the complex class can decide what sorting algorithm to use so there is a lot of flexibility that comes in because of using the strategy pattern basically you can dynamically keep changing the strategy and see the right one for your particular context thanks for joining more than a million students who are learning from us at in 28 minutes we defined a learning road map for java and front end developers we created more than 25 courses covering all the topics that you are seeing on the screen there are four things you can do to make best use of these courses number 1 is udemy you will find a link in the description of the video to our udemy profile we are teaching a lot of courses on udemy and most of them are free number 2 visit our website www.in28minutes.com you'd find tons of information including how you can register for our trainings and the link to udemy and our github code as well number 3 visit our github repository with more than 20 repositories covering varied examples It's a comprehensive source of information and code. Last but not the least, you'll find a set of discount codes for all our Udemy courses in the description as well. Feel free to use them. Good luck from the team here at In 28 Minutes, your destination for high-quality step-by-step -step courses.